Good morning and happy Thursday. Soft jar, sad, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Veterans Day is tomorrow. Throughout these few days, we will be honoring those who have served our country. From the Army, Noah Coleman is honoring his grandpa. Dale is being honored by Emily Bright. My great-grandfather is dead, resting peacefully in his grave. I just wanted to do this because I didn't get to hang out with him often, so I wanted to honor him. Nestor Montez is being honored by Corelli Montez. Nestor Montez is my older brother and has been serving in the National Guard for the past seven years. Although he is not yet a veteran, my family and I are all proud of his hard work and dedication towards serving our country. Jimmy Reed is being honored by Connor. James Reed is being honored by Connor Perryman. From the Marines, Mr. Everett is being honored by Mrs. Everett. Thank you for serving our country. Keith Benefield is being honored by Sean Barker and family. Thank you for your service, Keith. And from the Navy, Charles G. Hale is being honored by Martin, Angela, and Carson Hale. We are so thankful for your we are so thankful for Chuck's time in the Navy, as he has served in our great country. He was a selfless man who gave up for himself constantly. He will be missed by us all each and every single day. Thank you to these veterans for their sacrifices. Now we're going to send it off to sports and weather. What's up, dogs? The Lady Dogs are in action travel to Western tomorrow night for a JV and varsity contest with the games starting at 6 p.m. Good luck to them. Also, attention students, FMS included. If you bought a student pass, you have a shirt waiting for you down at the athletic office. Please see Mrs. Palmer to receive your shirt. That's all for sports. Now let's send it to Austin with the weather report. Thanks, Nelson. The high for today is 72, and that's the warmest it's going to be for a while, so get ready for the cold weather. The low for today is 51, and that's all for the weather. Now back to your hosts. Thank you, Austin. Student Council is having a sock drive on November 14 to 18. Students and staff will be competing with each other on who can get the most socks collected. Our community is in need of socks. You can drop them off at Student Services. Cash donations will also be accepted in Ms. Maudie's room. A quick reminder, the Doghouse Committee is selling holiday hot dog t-shirts. If you are interested, please make sure to pay the exact total in, class in cash only. Orders will be due in the office by Monday, November 14. More information about this will be posted in the chatter. This year's SAD will be putting up a thankful tree in the comments. This morning, they passed out leaf-shaped sticky notes to communities. Not every community received one, so they can use normal sticky notes. Teachers will be passing them out to their community kids. They can write something they are thankful for, something kind or encouraging words. They have to be school appropriate. SAD members will be, will be collecting the sticky notes on Monday from each teacher. They will be going to them, they will be going through them to make sure they are school appropriate and then they will go up on the tree. A happy birthday goes out to Yami Lopez and David Santiago. For lines one and two are cheeseburgers, lines three mini corn dogs, and lines four pizza and sides are potato smiles and baked beans. That's all for today's news. Make sure to like and subscribe and have a good Thursday.